Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, people of all ages, welcome back to another episode of Devil's Den. And tonight, tonight is the best night that Devil's fans have experienced in almost 10 years. Say it with me, the New Jersey Devils are going to the second round. Devils win tonight's game 4-0 in game 7 against the New York Rangers. The New York Rangers and they got demolished. The Devils had their number since puck drop, since the first period. Devils were all over them. Devils win this one for nothing. And again, the New Jersey Devils are going to round two. Oh, it feels so good to say that. Feels so good to say that. Because if you had told me last year at the end of the year that New Jersey would not only make the playoffs, would not only finish third in the league, second in the Metro, would go up against the Rangers in the first round and win, I would have called you an idiot. I would have called you an idiot. But tonight, tonight, I have been made a believer. Praise the New Jersey Devils. Oh, second round, here we come. Carolina, buckle up, because you thought you had a storm on your hands. Oh, boy, you have no idea what's coming to you in round two. You thought that Boston being kicked out in the first round was a surprise? Wait till it's Leafs-Devils in the Eastern Conference Final. I dare you to tell me otherwise. I'm calling it right now. I am saying it right now. My prediction for Carolina, New Jersey is Jersey in seven. I don't think the Devils win the cup without playing almost 30 games. All right? I'm going to say it. I just, I can't. This game was wild. So, <coughs> let's break it down. Period by period. Oh, my, boy, my throat is killing me already. Oh, God. So, first period. From the puck drop, Devils are all over them. They are in their zone. They're not letting up. We're cycling. The Rangers are trying to clear. I don't friggin' think so. And the Devils take the pucks off of them. They're ripping it off of them. Poking sticks up. Grabbing the puck. Cycling it back and forth and back and forth until finally... <sighs> until finally... In the second period, Michael McLeod, fourth line heart and soul, gets the goal. And it's a beautiful, beautiful little goal. Works in front, pops that puck in. It's one nothing Devils. And I am sitting in my basement with my family, cheering. Not all of them are Devils fans. We'll get to that in a second. But... Devils are up one nothing. Okay. Oh boy. Period. Uh, first period ends. It's nil nil. They score early in the second. My God, what a game! What a game for McLeod. What a game for Palat. What a game for Brat. What a game for like and for 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 Hala. Hala scores is oh my God. Like everything about this game was perfect. Schmid. Gets the shutout with some of the best glove saves I've seen from a New Jersey Devil goaltender since God himself, Martin Broder. okay? God himself could not have scripted better glove saves. Um, God, like there's so much to talk about. Um, uh, Hala, I'm literally stepping on the cord to my camera. Stop doing that. Um, they played so well. This game was Perfect. Perfect. Okay? They took a couple penalties here or there, but it doesn't matter because if you don't score on your own power play, it, it was for nothing. 
And the Rangers had nothing. They had nothing left in the tank. Nothing to, like, fight back with. I feel so bad for Igor Shesterkin, okay, who is hung out to dry every single game because they won't just play defense. And speaking of defense, can we agree on something? Jacob Truba is a bitch, okay? I'll say it loud and I'll say it proud. Jacob Truba is an absolute bitch. You're going to tell me that's not a headshot? He drives his... <coughs> he drives his shoulder into Meyer's head. It is the principal point of contact, to quote the rule book, and it's a no call. He levels him with a headshot. The cheapest, dirtiest headshot I've seen in quite some time. Um, oh, I was, I was jumping out of my chair watching that happen. And I'm saying, oh, that's going to be a penalty, right? Five minute major, right? Because he headshots him? No. Why would it be a penalty? Why would the refs call a headshot a penalty? Why Why would I ever expect that? And I, I don't want to do the whole, you know, oh, the refs are siding with the Rangers. Oh, you know, the refs are red books. I don't believe in any, of that, in any of that stuff, guys. I don't. Neither should you. But my God... That was as crystal clear a headshot as anyone could have, like, you couldn't have scripted that better, okay? You couldn't. And, like, I just, oh, God, like, I'm so glad Meyer came back into the game and, like, ended up feeling okay. But that was wild. But that wasn't a penalty. I literally... In my, like, jumping out of my chair, freaking out watching that happen and going, oh god, oh god, is this it? Like, at this point, it's three, at this point, it's two nothing devils. Almost three nothing devils. And, like, I feel like, I'm sorry, I know a lot, and, and by, oh, speaking of people, the ESPN broadcasters were caught saying, and I quote, oh, uh, I'm pretty sure he drove through the body. What game are you watching? <coughs> How much drugs are you on? And can you share with me? Okay? Share with me your, I guess, 2 IQ on how you think that's a body play. I am literally losing my voice screaming. Jesus. Holy hell. But it doesn't matter. Because you know what? I don't... You know what? It's fine. Because Jacob Truba is already suspended. He's already suspended for his head on Meyer. Because he's not playing till next October. Because the Rangers couldn't do the job. Instead, you know who could do the job? It's the New Jersey Devils. Oh, God. Um, who? <coughs> These playoffs have been absolutely crazy so far. You've got Bruins going out in seven, which, by the way, I called that. I said to my family, wouldn't it be funny if Boston goes out in the first round of the playoffs? I literally said, no one has that good of a regular season without getting tossed in the first, if not second round of the playoffs. Florida wins in seven. Leafs make it to the second round. Eastern Conference finalists, New York Rangers, get ousted by the Young Kid Devils team in seven. So, like, you've got Carolina and Devils, Toronto versus Florida, and then in the West, you got Seattle tossing out um, Colorado. So that's a whole shebang. You got uh, who's who? You got Vegas versus Edmonton and Seattle versus Dallas. At this point, anyone can win the cup. Anyone, any one of these teams can win the cup. <clears throat> Toronto has a real shot. Florida has a real shot. New Jersey, Carolina, Seattle, Vegas, Edmonton, Dallas, they all have a fair shot at winning the cup. But we all know, we all know, we all know. We all know who's going to win the cup this year. We, I'm saying it now. I wasn't ready to say it at the beginning of the season for fair reason. I wasn't ready to say it at the end of the, at the, end of the uh, season. I wasn't ready yet. I wasn't ready 
during this series, given the competition, but with every one of the big hitters out, Boston, Rangers, Lightning, all out, I'm going to say it, I think New Jersey has a legitimate chance to win the cup this year. I do. I'm going to say it. <clears throat> as long as everyone stays healthy, as long as our big guys stay healthy, if New Jersey plays the way they did tonight in games three and four, in games five, in game seven, they win the cup. No one beats them. Now, Carolina is a good defensive team. That's true. But New Jersey has shown me that they can play just as well in their own end as they can in the opponents. And that's what matters. It's just, it's, it's so good. It's everything. And to quote Emperor Palpatine, everything is proceeding as I have foreseen it. Oh. <sighs> The New Jersey Devils are going to the second round. Never thought I'd be able to say that. Never thought I would be able to say those words to myself and not be lying. <sighs> I don't know what else to say. True is a bitch. Devils are going to the second round to play Carolina. First game is probably going to be Wednesday night, which I will be watching that. And there will be a Devil's Den after that game. Or the next day, I should say, probably, most likely. No, it'll probably be that night. But yeah, um, crazy night. Crazy night. Thank you, Hala. Thank you, Palat. Thank you, McLeod. Thank you, I, who, who did I say? McLeod. Palat, no, McLeod. Who scored to I don't even know how who scored tonight. McLeod scored. Brett scored an empty netter. Um Hall has scored. Who scored the second goal? How do I not I just finished watching the game. How do I not remember who scored? Anyways, it doesn't matter. Because Devil will win 4 0. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen. Boys and girls, Devil's Den will continue Wednesday night as the New Jersey Devils play the Carolina Hurricanes in the second round of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Until then, guys, I'm going to wrap it up here. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Adios.